YouTube family, what go on? Maverick in the space again. Best and most credible opinion, fear. And fearless analysis. I'm just going to freestyle today. I'm just going to watch a trap meet over Hungary. Involving a plethora of Jamaican athletes. But most of them are MVP athletes. I look at it and I say, what? Wow, it's an MVP jamboree. And of course, a big race for everybody that I look forward to. The men's 100 meters. Can the new star boy, Kishian Thompson, taking him talents to the wider world now, slowly but surely. Him obliging at the 100 meters with easy. That's where the field 9.91. And it's a big feeling beat, you know. Simbini from South Africa. Tobogo, other African runner. Him put on 9.91, as me say. And look like maybe we can say generally now. The favorite to win the 100 of Paris. I mean, none of the American they never win in another race center, but it's still a solid field. And the way we win, the manner we win, he execute and him, cover the field and him, cruise and him. For that mistake, him shot down, like maybe with about 10 meters to go. Easy win for Kishian Thompson. Of course, there were some other races to where Tia Clayton was second. 11-0, Marsh, behind Tamara Davis, 11-0. But look here, people. The big news is that Sharika Jackson look like she pull up in the 200 meters. If you watch the race, you heard the scream. You saw the grimace. Ah! Loud grimace. Julian Alfred kind of shot out on the outside her and her leader and like she had go for the overdrive now. She catch Alfred and actually pass her about like she go for overdrive now for, for put to the race and like she feel something man. She go up and go, ah! She never go down on the track. She actually walked off the track, walked across the finish line. So if you look some encouraging news, that is it. But you know why you top athlete? By the way, she did have the Kinesian tape on the back of her, what was that? Her right foot? Is that the right foot or the left foot, I think? So she never look. Like she are 100% going into the race. What am I bridging to strategy? Say she put on the tape on her foot. Never plan to finish the race because, you know, you don't mind games before the Olympics. But we don't buy that. But again though, you know, in situations like this, you have to pick the positive, you know. Hope she has strategized, friend has strategized. And she not really seriously injured. Or hope that the fact that she walk off on the track, by her own free will. Means uh, it's not as serious as it appeared initially. Because you know if it's as serious, I mean that, you know. If it's as serious as a brand new hamstring, you know, so she's going to lay down and curl up on the track. And my understanding is that she has she, she treated her discomfort uh, for the whole season, you know. Yeah, man, remember when you tell us that Sherry can have a feel something too. But me, I think about it when I watch a race too. The fact that she have a tape on her foot, show you say she not one full hundred percent all right with it. And it's when she go for that extra gear there. But we are saying, if you know you have that something that is so close to the Olympics, man. You make Alfred go out with the little race. And you cruise and shut down and come even third and fourth. Not no wrong with that. And let's take affect her money. Which the bigger picture is Olympics a few weeks away. Unfortunately, when it, any, oh, you take it, you know. Remember from last World Championships, I tell you, say, Sherika Jackson had a 200 meter, meter to represent Jamaica's surest medal in another era. You know, you can't go bank for a medal. She out of class another event there. That event is the event. No, everything. We have to just wait and see what the outcome is, see what the diagnosis is. See if it was just a minor cramp, that it could be. See if it was a little bit more than a cramp. And see how early she can go back in her training. How much rest she can get. How much time. Whatever happened, I'm going to take for heal. We can go more than that, you know. Yeah. So it's a bittersweet day for Jamaica. Bittersweet day for MVP. Bittersweet day for Coach Stephen Fernando Francis. Because while Kishin showed the world. Say, him is for real. The real deal herself, Sherika Jackson, had to pull up 
before the end of the race. And boy, you could hear a pin drop <laughs> in the in this TVJ sports department when they watch a race. You know. Yeah, man, you know, so the place full up like a grandstand. When Cherika pull up, you could hear a pin drop. And I assume that would have been the case all over Jamaica and all over the world with track fans I watch. When you see a situation out of your control, all you have to do is do what you can do and then hope for the best, you know. If you're a praying person, you put in some prayers. But you don't look good for Jack O'Gan down like that. Well, she never went down, in fairness. She never went down, in fairness. But she ain't no people. Me I try to think about it now. What no allies are going to do? What oblique civil are going to do? What this man and him, Jacobs from over Italy, we are come to come defend him type. What am I going to do for beat Kishian Thompson? They have to run 9-6 for beat him, you know? Yeah, they have to run 9-6. And no other money on 9-6, you know? In other words, I said to you now, so Kishian Thompson look like he's going to win that 100. All things will be equal. And of course, all athletes will be in fit. Look like he's going to win that, that 100, man. And you know, you expect the celebration from Jamaica. New star is born. But you know, so I talk to some people today and make them know, say, yo, you have to expect the equivalent pushback from the rest of the world, especially from America. You know? And the man never said, no, no, no. I said, no, man, think about it. If a, a coach, a renowned coach from upper America, did there somewhere some abstract track of create Olympic and world champions out of nothing, basically, People who were late bloomers were not even early track stars by and large. If any coach in there, anywhere in America, had this track somewhere out in the Midwest, and have produced world champions and world beaters and Olympic champions and world record holders at the frequency, at the spectacular frequency that Stephen Frano Francis was doing. The whole of Jamaica would be pointing fingers. So I don't say we have to point fingers, you know. But you don't know that you don't expect the reaction there from people all over the world. The reaction they have. Those guys are good, man, but you're going to get that. Can't make that deter you. Can't make that stop you. And those natural human reaction. And if you put the shoe on your foot and realize, say, you probably would have reacted the same way. If I need somebody in another jurisdiction and do a friend or do, then you have to just understand that, the levels. For all track fans, good day for Christian Thompson, not so good day for Sherika Jackson. Step in time, my friend. Step in. Boom. Step in.